Hello guys, welcome to Physics Insight. In this video, we will discuss how to calculate the specific capacitance from the cyclic voltammetry data. Before starting, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more such content. In the first part of the cyclic voltammetry video series, we have derived the expression from which we can calculate the specific capacitance. If you haven't seen the video or do not understand any of these terms, please have a look to that video. All things are explained in great detail. So let's start. This is the CV data that I have got from performing experiment. So let's analyze this data by plotting the CV curve. So the curve something look like this and just by doing some modifications to look it more better. This data is for scan rate value equal to 1 millivolt per second. So now what we need is to calculate the area under this curve. So we can we can calculate this area just by doing analysis and then mathematics, polygon area, open dialog, and just by selecting absolute area here, we can find out the area under this curve that is 1.5. 6 6 into 10 is power minus 4 as we are seeing here so using this value of area in the expression we can calculate the specific capacitance for our material so let's copy this value and paste it here like this in this plot we also see that our potential window is from minus 0.1 volt to 0.5 volt so our potential window that is delta v is equal to 0.6 volt so now proceeding further now we know every value in the expression a area equal to 1.66 into 10 power minus 4 that we get the, from the plot k that is the scan rate value that we set in the setup while taking the data that is equal to 1 millivolt per second then m is the active mass this is the mass which is dipped into the solution while performing the experiment delta v is equal to 0.6 volt we have discussed and putting all of these value in the expression we get the specific capacitance is equal to 138.33 farad per gram so this is how we calculate the specific capacitance hope you like the video please don't forget to press the subscribe icon